Incumbent Mayor Justin Elliker and his Republican challenger Tom Goldenberg both cast their ballots at Wilbur Cross High School. Now they're both on today's ballot alongside petitioning candidate Wendy Hamilton. Elliker, the Democratic candidate, is running for his third term as mayor. Goldenberg hopes to be the first Republican mayor in more than 70 years. He was cross endorsed by the Republican Party and the Independent Party. Former Yale New Haven Hospital nurse Wendy Hamilton is a petitioning candidate after earning enough signatures to be on the ballot. This election also has an important ballot question asking voters to change the mayoral term from two years to four years, which would also apply to alders. That has been a controversial topic in the city. While people head out to vote, both politically endorsed candidates Elliker and Goldenberg say this election is coming at an important time for the city. There's a lot at stake, right? New Haven has a lot of challenges, but we made an incredible amount of progress. And you think about the work that we have to do on housing, on public safety, on education. Um, there's a lot that people, I think, are uh, concerned about, but also just given how much progress we've made in the last four years, we're feeling a lot of momentum going into the election. I plan on fully staffing the police department and bringing back programs that intervene with at-risk youth to bring down crime. And I also plan on freezing property taxes to give the homeowners and the renters a break. The polls will close at 8 o'clock tonight. Now, for a full list of what you need to bring to a polling location or reminders about voting, you can head to our website, fox61.com. In New Haven, Lindsay Kane, Fox 61, Connecticut's News Station.